Thank you, Mr. Speaker. I won't. I'll make an attempt not to repeat anything that's. I will make an attempt to not repeat anything that's already been said. But I do believe, having tracked this issue very. Order. The Honourable Member for Saanich Gulf. Order. The Honourable Member for Saanich Gulf Islands has the floor. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. Having tracked, I will, again, I repeat, I will not say things that have been said by others. I, could, I associate myself with comments from other members of the opposition, but I wish to add this for your consideration. As you can see, tempers are flaring on both sides of the House. We have before us a Canada-China investment treaty without an opportunity to debate it. There is a reality here in terms of motivation which may affect the deliberate attempt to jam the personal account, the Honourable Member for Vancouver Kingsway, and that is that the NDP sent out a message urging people to write to members of the Trade Committee to ensure that they were going to allow a debate in that committee. I think the fact of the way this is unfolding, the failure to allow debate in the House, and the fact I know that, Mr. Speaker, in my own office, we've received thousands and thousands of emails. So I wanted just to suggest to you, Mr. Speaker, there is a motivation here to deliberately target the Honourable Member for Vancouver Kingsway. I thank all honourable members for their interventions on this and I will of course uh, look into this and come back to the House with a decision.